Welcome to the real world of real racing. That's right. This is probably one of the most dramatic intros I've ever done. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> but seriously, it is. All right. So we're going to start off with some uh, clips that will prove to you why you shouldn't go into an app, racing app, and start zooming around the corners at full speed, sharp turns, without using your brake. This is what happens. So, um, the, it's a little bit, the simulation in this game is a little bit more realistic, so, yeah, you don't want to do that. Go ahead and use the brake, because that's what it's there for. So, let's start out with a little introduction. You start out with uh, a choice of two of the first cars, and because uh, you, you have just enough to cover them. And, uh, anyway, everything else is uh, all set on automatic. There's a uh, auto accelerate on already, uh, steering assist, brake assist, and all that good stuff. But, if you want to go ahead and be a uh, pro, then, uh, yeah, shut it all off and go try to actually drive yourself. It's a lot harder than you think. Okay. So, um... In the middle of the screen, uh, top middle, there's a little mini map, very helpful to see where turns are up ahead. And if you tap and hold in that section, um, it will you can look behind you. It's a rear view mirror, which is uh, good for straightaways. Don't do it uh, in turns. In the top left corner is the pause menu. And in the top right is the uh, camera angle, where you can switch between the uh, bumper view, third person like this, or inside the car. Anyway, about the camera angles, um, yeah, you can get a switch between bumper view inside the car or third person like this, and uh, yeah. Um, the popular one is probably inside the cockpit, but I prefer third person. Uh, there's a one that's uh, it's kind of uh, zoomed out a little bit, the one I use. And yeah, so uh, let's see, that was a qualifier, I think, and I'm pretty sure. So, uh, or maybe not. <laughs> okay, that was a uh, time trial type thing. So, um, the there's drifting, you don't want to turn too hard, so uh, and it slows you way down. Any mess up can slow you way down and totally mess up the race. Um, if you turn into the grass, even touch it very much, it slows you down a ton, so you don't want to do that either. Uh, you want to try to stay on the track, but, you know, go for the insides, be smart about it. And, uh, anyway, the, the, uh, career has, uh, three difficulties, as always, and, um, the, it's not too hard, I mean, except on the, you know, the worst difficulty, but, you know, the other two, you know, it isn't too bad, um, to go through. But, uh, <laughs> it's fun. Um, this, what you're seeing right now, is a replay, which you can do after you hit a race, or if you, um, if you go on a time trial and just, you know, do your thing. <laughs> um, yeah. If you do a time trial from the main menu, uh, to beat a score, you can hit view replay, or you can view replay on any of them. But on that one, especially, you can upload it to YouTube, or Facebook, or Twitter, I think... Some, you know, different sites like that. Mainly YouTube, because that's what I like. And, um, <laughs> so, got some YouTubes. Yeah. And, um, anyway. So that's helpful. You can upload your U your replay of your race right to YouTube and to your account. And you can, um, what I'm doing here is multiplayer, local multiplayer. There's a multi regular multiplayer where you can, you know, it'll connect you with anyone. And that one is, well, um, the best idea for that, guys, is you're going to need to complete the entire career. So, um, and complete every all the challenges, everything, you know. And once you've finished it, you will get a car called the 1995 um, McLaren, uh, let's see, F1 GTR, I think. Pretty That's pretty close, anyway. And... That is, you can only get it for unlock by uh, completing the entire campaign type mode. And um, that is what pretty much everyone in multiplayer has. So um, if you came in late, like I did, you are out of luck until you get that car because it's probably, it's pretty much the fastest. So, um, but once you get that, you'll be able to probably compete. 
and with everyone else. But before then, no, nah, not even a chance. <laughs> they they just zoom way ahead of you. Not even not even a fair fight. But anyway, but uh, so this uh, that was a local multiplayer which you can play with your friends. Um, I'm not sure how many. Maybe I'm I'm pretty sure more than four. I think it said six, up to six. So if you your friends bringing their devices over and have the game, you can play together. Local multiplayer races. So that's fun. Um, let's see. When unlike uh, some of the other racing apps and stuff, um, that you know they stay whatever the car was that you know when they ch you challenge them in like a one head to head or something. Well, in those. <clears throat> Um, in this one, I mean, it actually matches your car, you know, so if you buy a really souped up car like this, um, it will, in the head-to-head, -head, it will change the other car to, you know, get a little bit closer and more equal instead. So it's, you know, it makes it a little bit more challenging. That's nice. But anyway, here's a, uh, cool little car I just bought. Um, and I also bought that other one in the local multiplayer, the nice other one looking like this. I'm sorry, I forgot what the name was. Yeah, they're very long. Very long, yeah. <laughs> Some of you probably already know. It's a Nissan, I know that. Anyway. Or, I'm sorry, I'm... Pfft, Nissan. Uh, BMW, I'm sorry. Anywho. <clears throat> so, let's back to that. Let's test it out on a track. <clears throat> so, there's different tiers. It starts out with, like, a rookie cup, you know, and a uh, tier or whatever. And, uh and moves up and there's five of them and it gets all the way to from pro to world class I think that's the last one and um, <coughs> you there are all kinds of different um, types of racing and all kinds of different tracks and very pretty tracks very well done um, the shadows and lighting is pretty cool you know the if you look at you know how the sun what you watch your shadow as you go around a track it will move around you uh, going under awnings and stuff it's pretty cool um, but anyway, let's see, what was I saying? I was saying that, wow, lost my train of thought. <laughs> yeah, I go off on the rabbit trails very often. But anyway, so, <coughs> it's a fast car, isn't it? <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so, it's a very, very good app if you like racing games. Um, it's quite fun. Spend uh, some time with that, and you know, have fun with it. Um, let's see. Okay, so uh, that's what I was gonna say. Okay, points. You get a um, you get uh, you know, of course, money to buy cars and and upgrade your car, uh, which you can do in the customization part. You can even change the color, and then uh, but anyway, you can buy stuff for that. Reputation, which, uh, yeah, helps in your...